crossover, sometimes referred to as a crossover utility vehicle, or CUV, is a type of vehicle that combines some of the best features of an SUV with the sportier handling and on the platform of a car. The Toyota Matrix is a great example of that. It's a compact crossover vehicle that helped redefine the concept when it first came out in 2003. And now, Toyota has redefined it again with the all-new second-generation Matrix for 2009. The overall goal of the 2009 Matrix redesign was to crank up the sporty appeal with coupe-like styling, a wider, lower stance, and better overall performance, while at the same time maintaining interior space for five. To achieve that goal, Toyota designers created a body structure that is a little more than a half inch longer and about a half inch lower than previous models. These changes essentially lower the center of gravity of the Matrix while still providing the sporty lines of a coupe that's fun to drive. The Matrix comes in three different trim packages. The standard Matrix, the S that we're testing today, and the XRS. For improved road handling performance, the S and XRS models have front and rear underbody spoilers and a rear deck spoiler is standard on all XRS models. And speaking of performance, let's take the Matrix down to Orlando Speed World Dragway and see how she does against the clock. Using our Stalker radar gun, we found the Matrix ran from 0 to 60 miles an hour in 9.63 seconds. She hit 58.5 miles an hour at the 1 8 mile mark, and she ran the NHRA quarter mile in 19 seconds flat, doing a speed of 76.4 miles an hour when she crossed the traps at the end. Speaking of the interstate, we found the Matrix was very sure-footed at highway speeds. She had good mid-range acceleration too, going from 55 to 70 miles an hour in just 5.5 seconds. And that's great to know when you're trying to pass somebody. The performance we see here is also thanks to her power plant. The Matrix offers your choice of fuel-efficient power, a 1.8 liter four-cylinder that produces 132 horsepower at 6,000 RPM or the 2.4 liter engine with dual overhead cams that cranks out 158 horsepower at 6,000 RPM. The 1.8 is coupled to a four-speed, super electronically controlled transmission for smooth shifting, while the 2.4 comes with a five-speed automatic. In this case, you shift sequentially from D to S, and then push the lever forward for upshifts and back for downshifts. While EPA estimates are 31 miles per gallon for the 1.8 and 29 miles per gallon for the 2.4, our 50-mile test showed an observed highway fuel economy of 30.5 miles per gallon at a constant speed of 65 miles an hour. Moreover, we found the interior of the Matrix surprisingly quiet, registering just 70 dB at 65 miles an hour. This is just 5 decibels different from the normal conversation at rest, which is 65 decibels on the A scale. Turning now to the interior, the Matrix is a 5-door crossover, again tying in a key feature from SUVs. Also, because the new Matrix is a little lower to the ground than its predecessor, the new sports seats have been redesigned and lowered to provide good headroom without making it difficult to get in and out of the car. Dual stage SRS airbags are also standard for the driver and front passenger, and the Matrix comes with an occupant detection system that can not only tell if someone's sitting in the passenger seat, but also if that person is a child or an adult. Now looking at the driver's console, the instrument panel and center console are designed to create the feeling of a cockpit, again keeping with the sporty theme. 